I'm going to be a bit provocative and say that YPS shrews are the most important projects <laughs> in the RSC calendar. They furnish new audiences, they furnish the future, they reconnect the fundamentals of theatre, they reconnect young people to theatre. It's trading on the future rather than trading on the past. It's making sure that Shakespeare is uh, contemporary uh, and not a museum piece. And the way to test that is by placing it in front of the future audience, an audience who don't have, who haven't learnt the conditional the conditioned patterns of receiving Shakespeare. Most of the children who will come and see this will never, A, never seen a Shakespeare and might never have been to the theatre before. So that's the joy, that's the absolute joy, because usually in the RST, in the Swan, there are those repeat theatre goers who we welcome. But when you go into a primary school in the suburb of Birmingham, you know you're not going to get them. You're going to get people who are fresh and new to it. And so your job as the director and our jobs as the theatre makers are to make a piece of theatre that speaks clearly, the story is told, the characters are vivid. It's not my job to confuse anyone or to try any high fancy notions or concepts. My mission is to tell the story. It's Shakespeare's text, though it's edited. It's an abbreviated version of the play, so this one lasts about an hour and 15 minutes. Shakespeare should be central to our culture. Young people are scared of it, or it is taught in a way that puts them off. So it feels hugely responsible to go into those places and to reinstate Shakespeare. The YPS productions are not just dropped into the school. There's no sense of hit and run about them. The children are prepared, they have workshops from the RSC's education department. Uh, they get to know the characters, they get a sense of the stories. And what's a joy for them is they want to see the characters. They've learnt about the characters. Uh, this, this afternoon in the school they wanted to know where Bianca was, they wanted to know where Petruchio was, and this was whilst we were having our lunch. So there's a buzz in the schools. After every performance there is something. When we're performing the play in The Swan, there are, uh, there's an opportunity for the audience to come back and, and ask questions of the of the characters as well as the company. Uh, in schools we do a much more formalized workshop where for 45 minutes the children get to ask those questions, they also engage with some Shakespearean text, they also think about the final speech of the play. And the responses we've been having with the show have been fantastic. You see it on the TV, it's not the same. You see it live in your school hall, it can blow your mind.